Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to take a look at my recent pickup from my local hobby shop, which is this right here. Alright, that's out the way. Well, this is a HO scale 60 foot uh, Berwick Hot Cube boxcar. Today I have the Conroe scheme out. It's the uh, large uh, Wheels on Rail logo with a large uh, Conroe print there on the top left hand side of the car. The car number is a CR223108, which all the lettering here are legible. Uh, without magnification, but if you want to see everything, you definitely got everything you can see with the magnifying glass. It's not in blur, not in bleeding. It's a great looking car. Well, also with this here, it has a uh, numerous of stuff to be applied parts, as far as the wire grab irons, the stirrups, the uh, door pivot rods, and the locking mechanisms for the door. All, all separately applied here on the car. And I'll uh, just take a swivel around here to the A side of the car, which uh, has a print on the top for the high excessive height car and no running boards in the car number, which is all legible and nothing's bleeding and none blurred. And also you have the tack board there. You got the end ladder with the etch metal walkway uh, platform and had a cut lever and plastic McCurry knuckles, which can be switched out. Um, but the only thing this car does not have is the brake holes, brake pipe holes. But it's cool though. See right here, the other side of the car, same thing. But it's, um, you know, nothing's bleeding. Everything uh, looks good. Uh, printers and font is uh, great on it. There's nothing bad that I can say about the car. Uh, well, it was one thing except for the brake pipe holes. But it's okay. You, you know, got your mile and skills. Put them to work. Swing it over here to this uh, beating the car up top. You have the legible print there for the uh, no running boards, the sets of hype cars, then the car number going down. You got the handbrake with the handbrake chain, and the um, walkway is an etched metal part, and the chain is going through the walkway there, which is a pretty neat prototypical. Then you got the tack boards, and you got the uh, in ladders there with the cut lever and the plastic knuckle. Uh, swing it around here. Let's look under the car. Under the car, this uh, has a 100 ton uh, truck with uh, rolling bearings there with 36 inch wheels. You have all the brake pipe and uh, plumbing under the car, which is uh, very prototypical and uh, looks great. Also, you got detail there for the floor and the um, cross bracing. Uh, this, this looks pretty great. I, I'm enjoying the model. Then also on the roof there, got your X paneling and silver or a gray. You know, depends on how you look at it. But all in all, this car is a very uh, good looking car. Um, I did check the wheel wheel uh, with the gauge here. I have. And uh, everything's in um, specs. So, um, thanks for watching. I'm going to shoot you with a couple more videos uh, with uh, pickups and uh, what's available um, that I come across. But there's plenty more things out there. But this thing, this is stuff I think is cool and uh, was neat. And uh, get big shout out to your, um, everybody out there doing the model railroad thing. You know, I'm glad to be doing model railroad. It's a great hobby. Best hobby in the world. But, uh, you know, thanks for watching. Hit you guys in another video. Thanks.